campers and crafters and welcome to our Friday online class. Please disregard my Verizon modem beeping in the background. I promise it's not a smoke detector. I just can't figure out how to shut the shut the sound off. And apparently I can't figure out how to shut the sound off on my computer either. So apologies for all of that. But welcome. Um, it is Friday. Yay. The weekend is coming. I have awesome projects to share with you today. I absolutely, absolutely love the cards that we're going to be making today. So much fun. But there is some very exciting things happening, and I want to tell you about them uh, before we get started. So I'm not sure where to start. Let's start with the giveaways. What do you think? Giveaways while you guys are popping on board? Let's do that. All right. So we are playing with the uh, January Paper Pumpkin. Um, this is the, the January Paper Pumpkin Kit, so I'm going, I'm going to be giving away January Paper Pumpkin Kit. So it is the Heartfelt Love Notes Kit. Um, these are the cards that it made. We, we made these cards live um, when I did my reveal when it first came in. They are stinking adorable. Adorable. And I have the video on how to make these, or better yet, how not to make them, on my, <laughs> on my resource page, which is already up on my blog. Just click on the link in this video's description. It also comes with directions. Um, for those of you that actually like to read directions, as you know, I don't. So mine don't always look like they're supposed to, but that's okay too. It's personal. Um, so what what we're giving away here is that Heartfelt Note Love Kit live. I'm going to draw two winners live. Two winners are going to win that ex this exact kit that we're working with today, brand new, unopened, in the box. All you need to do to enter, I didn't put my instructions out, is leave a comment. And um, if you are not able to watch the live, you can find the replay. Uh, we'll always be here on Facebook as well. We are live on Facebook right now. The replay will be here on Facebook forever. And it will also be on my blog, my stampwithtammy.com blog. And you can get to that by clicking on the link in this video's description. You will also find a free PDF there. I'll talk, talk about that in a minute. Um, the replay will also be on YouTube. Now you can leave a comment here on Facebook or on the YouTube video. It has to be on the actual video in either place following this video and you will still be entered to win. If you left a comment live and you didn't win a live, your comment will roll over into the after live. That was a question recently, so I wanted to make sure that I was clear on that. Yes, if you left a comment while you were live, you don't have to leave another one. You'll still be entered into the after live drawing. So if you're live, you actually have two chances to win with one comment. Now, a um, couple of bonuses with the uh, after live replay giveaway, and one is that I'm giving away a pop-up paper pumpkin scrap bin along with the kit. These are very coveted, and I understand they are um, going away. Stampin' Up! is not going to be make the, oh, it, it is something only demonstrators could get, but I think I heard that they're not going to be making them anymore, even for demonstrators. So, um, <laughs> pretty soon, these are going to be rare and hard to find items. They're rare and hard to find items as it is. Um, it's a little demo perk, and I'm giving one away for you guys. And pretty soon, I won't even have that. So, leave a comment. Now, the other bonus with the after live drawing um, is if you share my broadcast onto Facebook, share it onto Facebook, and then typed into the comments that you've shared it, I will enter you a second time. You'll get two entries into this replay drawing with the, the pop up scrap bin. So, everybody has a chance to win the kit um, on the replay, which I will draw the winner of that on February 23rd. And um, in case you're wondering, if you are wondering if you've won one of my replay drawings, if you've won one of my after lives and you're not sure where to find that, if you go to stampwithtammy.com, I have a page actually called Contests and Winners. And um, I announce all of the winners there and I keep them up there. You have two weeks to claim your prize or I give it away to somebody else. So make sure you claim your prizes. <laughs> make sure you get on there. I also, as well as them always being there, and these winners will be announced there momentarily following the broadcast, you will also find winners in my weekly newsletter that I send out every Tuesday along with free PDF card tutorials. It's a great resource, great place for ideas. I send out new videos, new card ideas, and new tu free tutorials all exclusive for my um, newsletters viewers so be sure to sign up for that as well so it's another place that I announced that the following the previous week's winners so those are two places where you can always find winners if you're not sure if you've won you want to know how to find out that's it I also do post them in the video like um, on February 23rd when I draw this winner I will post the winner um, in this video and I try to tag them if your Facebook allows me to I will tag you so that you get notified that I I posted something about you <laughs> something good and hopefully all your friends don't come knocking on your door going hey saw you on the paper pumpkin can't wait to come play actually maybe that's a good thing maybe you want that to happen okay 
So those are the giveaways. Be sure to leave a comment. You will be entered to win. Plus, it's a lot of fun because you interact and actually become part of the class. And I love that. I love doing these classes. Um, okay, so what's happening in Stamping News? Celebration. Celebration runs through March 31st. We are now um, coming up into mid-February. It's the 9th today. And on, on the 16th, which is next week, we will be uh, releasing three new uh, Celebration products that you can earn. They're very cool. Um, and I will post about them this weekend on my blog so you guys can see them. They're really cool. You're going to want them. Absolutely. I didn't want to teach you too early because you can't get them until the 16th unless you're a demonstrator. If you are a demonstrator, you can purchase them now. So Celebration, you get free products with every $50 order. Um, if you have a $250 order, if you're my VIP club hostess this month, um, you get bonus uh, rewards with a $250 order. And if you join to be a demonstrator, you get two free stamp sets. Plus you get to be a member of Stamp It and that's the best. <laughs> we have the best group. I love it. I love it. You see a lot of our Stamp It girls all over the place here on Facebook. Linda Cullen, Bobby Crouch. You see Brenda Diaz, Teresa Howe, Rachel, Rachel the Stamper. Uh, all Stamp It gals. We're one family that we just love to stamp. We love to share ideas. Mary Bush is up and coming here on Facebook. You'll be catching her live at five Facebook lives. Don't miss them. Um, and we'd love to have you join us. You can join with me. You can join with any of the girls and you will still be part of our family. Welcome aboard, everybody. Wow, it's getting very exciting out there. It's great to see you all. Okay, so um, with all this excitement, okay, I'm ready to share this exciting news. You know that I've been doing the countdown, and if you don't, I'm going to tell you about it. <laughs> I've been doing the countdown to 2 million, so I've been very close, very, very close, and now I am so close. It's happening. It's happening. I am about to hit uh, $2 million in career sales, and I'm I seriously, I'm like freaking out a little bit. It's going to happen and it's going to happen this week. In fact, I'm pretty sure it could, it's possible it could even happen this weekend. And I wanted to do something really special for the, the $2 million seller. No one's ever done this before. No one's ever hit $2 million. It's the first time ever, not to mention the highest sales in the history of the company. So it's huge. And, um, and when we hit $1 million, Rachel Reif at the time was my customer, and she was my million-dollar customer. She's now in, um, in my group, and she's like a million, <laughs> she's not a million-dollar seller yet, but she, someday she will be because she's amazing, right? Right? So, anyways, I wanted to do something special for that $2 million customer, but I was looking at things today and trying to figure out what to do, and when I looked at it, I said, oh my gosh, tomorrow's the 10th of the month which means paper pumpkin goes in. Tomorrow's the deadline for your paper pumpkin. And I have a huge paper pumpkin run. Like a lot of you are subscribed to paper pumpkin because we love it, right? Well, it looks like I may actually hit the $2 million with that pa with the paper pumpkin process on the 11th, which um, I think it's going to, any of the processes on, I don't know if it'll actually happen on Sunday or Monday, but when it happens, it, it looks like that might be when it happens. And so I don't think there's a way for me to tell exactly if the hundred plus people that subscribe to my paper pumpkin, who's going to be the, the magic customer. So what I thought I would do, this is my little countdown because we've been doing the countdown, having a little pre-celebration. Okay, so what I thought I would do, since I don't know if I can, I can d differentiate between all of you, is that I'm going to give everybody who subscribes to my paper pumpkin in February a little gift. So if you are a subscriber and you need to subscribe by the 10th, and we're going to we're gonna show you in a second why you want to do this, why you want to be a subscriber, because it's awesome. But if you subscribe to my paper pumpkin, um, under me in February, which the deadline's tomorrow. It doesn't matter if you are a regular subscriber, if you do it month, if you do like the prepaid monthly one, which I'm going to tell you about in a minute. Any, it, as long as you're active and your payment goes through, make sure your payments are all up to date on as soon as the run goes on the, either the 11th or the 12th. Um, you will, I will send you from me. So it's not going to come with paper pumpkin. It'll come separate. I'm going to send you a package of pearls to say thank you because I am so excited and I'm so grateful and all of this is just awesome. And I want to thank you for being a part of it. And, and my paper pumpkin people, thank you for being the, I literally, my paper pumpkin peeps, you, you are going to be the million dollar customer, $2 million customer. So I mean, wow, right? I'm like freaking out. So anyways, so that's my, my exciting news and um, little little party there. You can still sign up if you haven't signed up for yet. You can still do it. The link is on my blog. It's also in the video's description here. Um, just click on the link in the video's description and you can, you can do that there. Um, on top of that, 
so I had some little uh, little party going on. It was like a little like lead up pre celebration countdown party, and I'm giving away free sequins if you have a fifty dollar order. So that's part of that too. This is it could be combined if you do a prepaid paper pumpkin. This could be combined, um, or you, you know individually you could do either or. Um, so anyways, that's another perk. If you place a $50 in my, uh, order in my online store by the 15th, you also get celebration with that. So you'll get your free celebration product. And in addition and separate from the order, cause I'll be sh shipping this gift to you. It, you'll get 2D free sequins. So, ah, all kinds of exciting things happening. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it's happening. All right. I promised to tell you about the paper pumpkin thing. Okay. So you can still do this right now and get my paper pumpkin gift and get your February paper pumpkin. And that is combining paper pumpkin, the prepaid subscription with celebration and getting a free celebration product and getting my free sequins. And if you activate it by tomorrow, the 10th, you'll also get my, I'll also send you out a, um, the free pearls. So you can get it all. You can do it all. Um, this information is on my blog. This is just a little peek here. Um, it is on my blog. But yeah, so I'm like, whoo, breathe, breathe. <laughs> I'm so excited. It's really happening. I love you guys so much, so much. Okay, so uh, let's talk about what we're going to be making today. Um, I'm gonna calm down, breathe, breathe. Whew. Okay. Uh, we are going to be making this awesome, awesome card. I got this idea from Gail Murray. I love you, Gail. Thank you. Uh, she had played, uh, she combined the paper pumpkin kit um, with, and I'm just going to pop over because um, I'm i going to show you this. This is the Apron of Love bundle. Um, it's in the Occasions catalog. It's so adorable. So I'm actually not using the stamp set on this card, but you could. You could actually swap out, especially if you didn't have this paper pumpkin kit, you could swap out the stamp set. Um, for what we're using the stamp set for, but I'm actually using the dies, these dies, um, to create this card here. And she had done something so adorable. Whoops, wrong one. She had done something so adorable, and I kind of, um, I was really inspired by it. So I, I did change it up, but, but that's what we're going to be creating with the paper pumpkin kit. This is the heartfelt love note kit from January. February's will be totally different. Be very exciting. Um, so I'm just, I cannot like. Cannot say enough about Paper Pumpkin, and as you know, so I love it. I, I, I play with it every month. I always give you alternate ideas. Um, the Heartfelt Love Note Refill Kit is in my online store, and um, that will be, as it's while supplies last, and as we learned with yesterday's uh, Fast Few Sales, sometimes that means things sell out instantly. <laughs> Sometimes people get really excited and uh, they go. I'm not saying that's going to happen with the refill kit, but I am saying don't wait too long because I don't know how many they have. Um, okay, so that the, the refill kit's still available. That doesn't come with a spot. It doesn't come with a stamp set. If you want to see more about the kit, you can check out my video that I did with the, um, the paper pumpkin when I did the reveal. All right, so you guys ready to do some stamping? Let's, let's jump right in here. Okay, so... We are going to be making now. This is these are, these are the cards that the original, um, the kit. And if you were to make it by the what's in the box, these are what the box would make right here. There are these adorable little um, pull out love note cards. They are stinking cute, and they're on again. I I did a video on how to make them. There are instructions that come in the kit. Um, what I did was I took these supplies, the supplies that um, they send you with this box. And I kind of reworked them to make these super cute cards. I'm calling these his, oh, let's do it, his and hers, although it doesn't matter who's the he and who's the she here. I'm calling them his and hers, um, cooking a cooking card set here. These could be Valentine's Day. These could be birthdays. They really could be go, good for any occasion. Um, I had a lot of fun with it, again, using that um, the Apron Builder uh, dies with it. So much fun. So we have the baker here, with the baker with the, um, with the little... Um, all the baking utensils and here we have the griller the griller set and I combined them with the wood textures background to give you those cool backgrounds they're surprisingly very easy to make um, and so so fun okay so let's see Sherry's asking is the fast few sold out oh gosh yes that's sold out literally almost instantly you guys have no idea how many I think they posted the number how many fast views sold out it was like seven hours I've never seen anything like it you guys are crazy <laughs> everybody wanted that fast views so um yeah that's gone sorry it's not a, it's not only is the sale gone I'm pretty sure fast views is sold out um but <laughs> 
it's all good. If you got it in your cart, you got it. And if not, there's other there's other adhesives out there. There is really, quite frankly, I'm a, I'm a bigger fan of the tear tape than they. You know this. And and <laughs> Rachel and I we we go back and forth on this because Rachel loves her fast fuse so much. Um, but I am a huge fan of the the tear tape for the strong stuff. Anyway, so let's. I don't know. We're gonna make these both together. So what I did was I took um, one of each. One of each of these, um, let's see if I can get this to open correctly. One of, these are the cards that came in the kit. And what I'm actually going to do is use them more for um, designer paper than a card for this particular project. So, you, again, if you've used up all of yours, if you got the January kit and you used yours all up, you can purchase refills or you could use other designer paper for this. Um, one of these had some copper foil the copper foil hearts on it and one had white stripes so what I did was I matched them up with copper foil so the copper is on copper because you know how much I love copper right so we've got copper on copper here with the copper foil and then there's silver foil for the the silver the first thing I'm going to do now I took the wood textures designer paper and we're going to stamp the words and the words came from the stamp set but you could substitute so you could use that apron of love stamp set and, and substitute other words here i'm using the stamps that actually came in the in the kit and um, i'll show you those real quick these do not come in the refill so when you get a refill you don't get the stamp set but you do you can get um let's see there we go no no had it right the first time these are the cute little stamps they're so adorable they are so adorable the stamps that come in it there's an exclusive stamp set every month in, in every kit. Okay. Um, Samantha says she's having a hard time finding the winner's post page. Samantha, go to stampwithtammy.com or click on any um, Stamp With Tammy link in this video's description, the one with the resource page. And at the top of the page, on every page of my blog, it's called Contests and Winners. When you click it, boom, everybody's listed there. I think it goes back about four or five months, too. Although, if you didn't claim your prize from four or five months ago, I've already given it away to somebody else. Somebody else says thank you. <laughs> All right, so I'm using basic black um, to stamp these. I wanted the black to stand out on the darker wood because I was using the darker wood on the grill um, for the grill card. I don't know. It was just cute. I liked it together. All right, there is another little piece of stamping, but we need to do the big shot work first before we stamp our little XO, so we'll come back to that. All right. So we're going to put these aside. Uh, all the measurements, by the way, I promised I'd tell you about this, and then I moved it right out of the way and, and, and glossed right over it and didn't tell you about it at all. That wasn't very nice of me. I'm sorry. Um, for every online class that I have, I have a free PDF, and um, it has all of the measurements on it that we're using today. It has a picture of the, a picture of the cards. I also have close-up pictures on the, the resource page, was, which is on the link of this video's description. And I've got a complete supply list and a place here for you to take some notes. These are free. Just click on the resource page in the link in the video's description. And also the replay of the video will be there as well. I have the URL of the resource page listed right here. So if you are making this later, not making it with us live, and you want to go back to it, just simply type that in. And um, if you have a smartphone, you can actually use the uh, QR code to get there. Okay, let's do our big shot work. Who's ready for the big shot? Because you have to be a big shot, did you? You knew that was coming, right? I am not, I cannot be the only one that sings that song when they play with the big shot. <laughs> Billy Joel just can't help it. He had no idea what he was starting. Okay, here is a magnetic platform. You could also use the um, the platform that comes with the big shot machine and put the thin die adapter on it if you wanted to. But we're using the magnetic platform today, and I'm going to take. I've got, I'm going to cut out the aprons first. Mm, I got to cut them out individually, right? Because hmm. I only have one apron die. Okay, so. We're going to run it through twice. I was going to do them together, but since I only have one die, we'll do them twice. So it's the apron builder dies that we have here. They are so flippin' adorable. Seriously, can't stand it. All right, we're going to start with the grill card. And that's the stripes. Um, so for that one, we're taking this little square, which is a pocket. And I want to make sure that it's going to be opposite when I put it on there. Um, opposite the pattern from what the... Um, the apron is and we need a little 
handle on there. Actually, let's move this. It doesn't seem to be laying flat. So let's move that over there. We'll put the handle over here. And then we are going to put one cutting pad on top and crank that through. And that will give us our apron pieces for one. And then we are going to, I'm sorry if I'm off screen there a little bit. Ha, ah, Janet says she sings a little Billy Joel every time she uses the big shot too. Good. And if you didn't, you do now. <laughs> I got it stuck in your head. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Happy weekend. You're welcome. Okay. So I'm going to take that same apron die, but we're going to swap out here the same apron and the same top but we're going to swap it out with this, this little die here for a little frilly piece. Okay. And then we're going to use this hearts. I'm going to make sure the hearts are facing the right direction because on this particular card, it matters. So put that in there and lost a die. Anybody see what I did with it? I slid it off. It was the, um, Shout it out if you see it here. <laughs> with the top, the top to the uh, to the apron. What the heck did I do with it? Oh my gosh! Our apron is. Oh, I heard it! I heard it! There it is! Shoo! All right, try that again. All right, so we're gonna put our apron down. Put that in there. I'm gonna put our little. Look for it. Stop moving on me. There is a ghost in the machine. Oh, I think it's on there. I think we're good. Okay, so. Oh, you Ohio girls are cracking me up. Do you know, a couple of weeks ago, I was um, looking at one of my, my um, videos. I was doing something with it. And when I looked at it, Facebook popped up and said, you have a, um, a high number of people from Ohio watching. <laughs> That's awesome. I love it. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. So I love you guys, Ohio. I love you. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Yep, that worked out well. Okay, so we've got our pieces to the apron cut. Now we need one more cut here from the Big Shot, and that is going to come from our utensils. So there's two, actually two separate sets of utensils. There's a rolling pin. There's some other things going on there. Um, what I'm doing is I'm taking the actual layer of the foil, the silver and the copper foil, and I'm going to cut the utensils right out of the middle, and then I'm going to layer it in the card after. So I'm cutting them out of the middle of this section, but you're not going to see it because we're going to put designer paper over it. Now, let's see if I got them. I got them backwards. Okay, so grill goes on silver, baking set goes on copper. I saw some copper bakeware at Target today, and I was like, perfect. Okay. All right. Yes, Tina says that little thinlet that was that was hiding on me and not cooperating definitely needs a timeout. <laughs> it totally needs a timeout. Okay, so now that's... <laughs> do you see how easy that was? These things are the cutest, cutest little... I love them. The cutest little things, these bakeware things. Okay. All right, so this most of the pieces popped right out. This little whisk didn't. So if you have any hangers on, just take a little... Take a little paper piercer, pop it out. Okay. So let's just move the big shot out of the way and I'll show you all these cute little things that just came out of there because I can't stand it. I really can't stand how freaking adorable these things are. Okay, so we've got our grill set here. These are our little grilling pieces. They're silver. Way too far out. You guys need a better view of that, right? Totally, totally need a better view of that. Okay, so you've got silver there. There's a couple little whisk pieces in here. And copper is our bakeware. So a couple of these are still sitting in our copper foil. Do you love them? Oh, so cute. All right, so that is, we've got bakeware, we've got grillware. And now we've got one more little thing to stamp. Now, when we put together, when we cut out the pieces to the apron here from the, um, the mini love notes, the flip side of it that was this flamingo. Um, these guys need a little, got to poke some extra holes out there. It was that flirty flamingo. 
So um, I'm going to use that on the bakeware apron. Although if you could flip it back and use the black side if you wanted to. I'm calling them his, his and hers, but your your hip your your he could be the baker. <laughs> it could be his and his, hers and hers. Really could go either way. I just thought it was cute because it was like a little set, and I love the whole the baking and all of it, how it all goes together. Just love this idea. All right, so and then I flipped this over to get the the flirty flamingo side for the apron there. So we've got our all of our apron pieces. So we've got the grill apron here, and we've got um, the baking apron. All right, so there was one little piece that I wanted to go back and stamp, and that was this little XO on this the little pocket. So I've got a little black ink pad here. We're going to stamp that right in the center of the pocket. And we'll back you back out so you can see what's happening. And I am going to do some assembly. We're going to put our apron and utensil stuff together. And we're going to use the um, mini glue dots for this. See, Fast Fuse people, there are other adhesives out here in the world. Just saying. <laughs> oh, I told Rachel, I thought Rachel the Stamper, I thought she was solely responsible for that <laughs> demand. The demand of Fast Fuse. She loves Fast Fuse so much. Okay. So these guys, I am, I don't know if you, you can see what I'm doing here, as I'm, I'm just doing it, gabbing it, I'm not telling you. I'm sticking the glue dot to the front of each set of utensils and then popping them underneath here in the little, the little apron. Sherry's asking how we adhere those little tools. Now, now you know. Now you know the secret. Just a little mini glue dot down there and... We've got our little baking utensils. They're already in the pocket. And then the same thing for this little uh, neckline. Let's get, this is what, you know, holds the apron on your neck. I'm sure there's a fancy name for it. You sewers out there would know. Okay. <laughs> Sandy says I'm an enabler. Yeah, probably. But you guys are too, because I get inspired by you guys. And then I have to go, I mean... I, who knew how badly I needed this apron set until <laughs> until I saw some of the stuff made with it. And I was like, oh my gosh. Yeah, that's back at you. <laughs> We're enablers together. We're in this together, you guys. You inspire me, inspire you, inspire me, inspire you. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a team. We're a team, you guys. All right. So, we've got our little baker's apron here. So cute. And then we are going to get going with the grill. Put the grill together. Our grill apron. And let's see. We've got to look at the little baby tongs. How freaking adorable are these? I can't stand it. You know this one's coming back for Father's Day. You know it. The little baby tongs. And I want to make sure the pattern's opposite here on the pocket before we put it in there. Kind of line it up. Okay. And we've got the little... So cute! <laughs> this is... Um, Connie's asking what the name of it is. This is the Apron uh, apron of Love uh, bundle. I'm actually just using the Apron Builder dies today, but it goes with the stamp set. Um, and they are in the Occasions catalog. This information is also on my blog, and it's also on that free PDF. Alright, so we've got our little utensils inside the pocket. It does sound like a song, doesn't it, Karen? Totally agreed with you there. I could make one up. Apron of love. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> Might as well face it, you're an apron of love. Okay, so, oh my gosh, I love it. I love these so much. <laughs> I couldn't wait to do this today. After I made these cards, I'm like, oh my gosh, they are so cute. I'm like, we have, I cannot wait. I can't wait till Friday. I almost had to do it early. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't do it too early. I know some of you plan on the times so you can sneak out for your lunch break, but still, I wanted to. I was that excited about it. 
and I'm so excited for this, uh, for the paper pumping, you know, to, to process this month, because I really think, I, I really think that that is going to be the, you guys, my paper pumpkin peeps, you guys are going to be my $2 million customers. I'm so excited. So if you guys missed out on that, I'll tell you about it real quick. Um, I'm very, very, very close to hitting that, that $2 million milestone, which is I'll be the first person ever in the company. So the highest sales in the history of the company and the first time ever this has been done. And um, it's looking like the Paper Pumpkin, February Paper Pumpkin is going to be um, due tomorrow and then they do a run. And I don't know if it'll be the 11th, this is Sunday. So it, it might be Monday's the run where they, they process everything and they start shipping everything out. And when that happens... I'm pretty sure that's when I'm going to cross over. And I wanted to do something really special for my two, my $2 million customer, like I did when I had a $1 million, my first $1 million customer. And um, when, I, when I looked today and realized that it was probably going to happen during Paper Pumpkin and saw that, you know, it's going to be a whole bunch of you going to be going to actually be all of you. And I didn't know there's a way that I can di differentiate. And I'm like, I don't want to. I want all of you to be the $2 million customer. So anybody who has subscribed to me in February and Paper Pumpkin is going to get a special gift for me. Um, and that, that's all on my blog as a, as a thank you gift for being my $2 million customer. So that's very exciting. I can't wait. And I am um, searching here for my dimensionals. Don't know where I put them. So I'm just like frantically, I wonder if they fell on the floor. Yeah, they did. They're on the floor. Of course they are. Of course they are. That's never happened to you guys, right? Okay. <laughs> I will definitely be live. Tina's like, you better come on live when you hit. I will definitely be live. All right. So here's what we got. I'm going to do a little um, dimensionals on these aprons to put them on their, their card fronts. I love these little pop dots. Okay. Yes, and don't forget that um, tomorrow is the deadline. Uh, Saturday, February 10th is the deadline to sign up for the February Paper Pumpkin. I mean, it's great on multiple levels, but it's going to be a very, very special month for me. <laughs> I'm so excited for all of us. I feel like that you guys, I feel like you're all in this journey with me and I'm so, I'm so happy you guys are here with me. So exciting. Okay. So let's go ahead and put these aprons on. Oh my gosh. I love it. Aren't they adorable? Okay. So for the, um, these pieces, I just to kind of, you know, get as much as I could out of that foil sheet. I am, uh, I cut those utensils right out of the middle of them. So I'm going to take snail adhesive because that's my favorite. If you guys ever bought them out of snail adhesive, I would die. <laughs> I don't think I could handle it. Oh, I'm so addicted to snail. So we're going to, now we're just um, assembling. So we're just putting these pieces together. And then, then I'm layering on black again. All the, the measurements and the supplies that I'm using are on my blog. Here's what I found something weird about the coating on the back of the, the copper foil. For some reason, I was getting a, having a hard time getting the adhesive to stick to it. It stuck just fine, but I had to put the adhesive on the bottom layer and then press into it. For some reason, this, the coating, it wouldn't, when I put the, the tape runner on it, it didn't, it didn't stick to it. And I didn't have the same problem with the silver. It seemed to only happen with the copper. All right, so... Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Okay. You have not missed Diana. You have not missed signing up this month. Oh, do you mean for January? If you meant for January, then um, you did miss it, but you could still win one, and you can still get the refills in my online store. Um, I am giving three kits away, two live and one after live, for January. But you haven't missed the February. The deadline's tomorrow for February. Love those paper pumpkins. Everything comes in this kit. They're the best. They are the bomb. And I just, I'm so excited that it's going to be paper pumpkin. Paper pumpkin's going to be the $2 million customers. Ah, ah. Okay, so, I know, I'm trying to contain myself. So, I did one other little thing on these little uh, aprons here, and that was with um, with our baker, baker's apron. I didn't put the purple onto the grill one. I didn't, I didn't think that looked good, but you could if you liked it. Um, but I did take, these came in the kit. These were part of the kit. They're like a little glitter, and there's flamingo, and there's um, 
fresh fig, but on the baking one, I loved this little flirty flamingo. I'm not flirty flamingo. Um, yeah, that's flirty flamingo. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I'm thinking sweet sugar plum, but no, it is flirty flamingo. So I put a couple of those little, because you can't go wrong with these guys. You really can't. So I put a couple of these little guys on, um, on the apron and our cards are complete. Then we have our whole set. So we've got our grill card. We've got our baker card. Just love them. That's a whole set right there. Quick, easy. We've all just added a little bit of the, the wood texture DSP. Um, if you're not familiar with this, um, here's one of my mini packs. <laughs> but they're so fun. Look at the, all the different designs that you have to play with here. Some of them look like, you know, like wood logs. Some of, There's a lot of wood plank. Great backgrounds. Great backgrounds in this designer paper series. Okay, so that concludes the stamping portion. Um, I'm just going to pop on over here and uh, we are going I have a, I have two January paper pumpkin kits that I just played with to give away and um, if you don't win one of the lives I also have one for after live and before I before I do before you guys jump off this is big next Tuesday for my online class is going to be a little bit different this is a very it's going to be an informational um, <laughs> episode of our um, online class that's next Tuesday's class at noon live here on Facebook and that is going to be what you need to know about retiring in colors which flirty flamingo is one of them very important information I want to get it out to you early especially in lieu of the fast view selling out as fast as it did some of these colors are about to sell out really really fast and I want you to be able to have time to budget and get the stuff that you need before that happens so we're gonna get you informed early so that you guys you you can, you can collect the stuff you need now, especially during celebration, before it starts to sell out. All right, let's do a giveaway. So I've got two paper pumpkin kits to give away here. And we are going to pop over to the giveaway site. And the first one for that heartfelt thanks giveaway is going to be... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> the suspense. I know. The suspense. All right, the first one's Donna Billingsley. Congratulations, Donna. Love you from Colorado Springs. And the next one is Linda Shepard. Excellent. Awesome, Linda. All right, so Linda and Donna, be sure to fill out the prize claim form. Simply click on the link in this video's description. It does say um, winners and prize claim form. Um, and you can also get to it from my blog. If you are not a winner, don't worry because I still have... Um, a one kit with the, with the much coveted scrap bin to give away and that one I'll be doing the drawing on February 23rd. Winner will be announced here on the Facebook video as well as the winner's page, my newsletter. So you'll be able to find it in any of those places. Be sure to make sure that you, you go back and look there if you have entered and I love you guys. So excited. Have a wonderful weekend and I will be back here and as soon as I hit that, as soon as I hit that milestone, as soon as I hit that big two million, I promise I will be on here. I will be on here celebrating with you guys. Love you. Have a wonderful weekend. Thanks for joining me today.